But yeah, you know what I'm saying? I'm just being foreign. You got foreign thoughts. You got alienistic thoughts. You know what I'm saying? Because your thoughts alienate you from anybody else's thoughts around you and shit like that. So that's when you got a, a, a different type of spaceship from a different planet, different water cycle. You know what I'm saying? So when it comes in this water cycle, it's like toxic. Other people may see it as toxic. You to see it as different. Because the term dirty and shit like that, the each object that mixed together ain't dirty on its own. The same way, the only thing, some, only time something is wet is because it got water on it and it's not water. That's the only time something is used as the term wet. So when you come in here with a whole different chakra, hold it from a whole different world, planet, and shit like that, galaxy, waters, and shit, then hell yeah, you ain't going to mix well when it comes to people's ideas and thoughts. And, you know, if you go too extreme on your shit, people might try to justify that you and your ego or some shit like that and use this term humble. Know what I'm saying like you ain't supposed to be modest. They should, you being modest is just you even being respectable enough to even know where everybody at on a level. Once one of them flunked that ass motherfuckers start to use your kindness for weakness, then they're going to start using that witchcraft humble and keep you trapped down there in that world they at. And that's when you really got to use your ego. To, then that's when it's time to fight fire with fire because motherfuckers have forgot who you was at that point. And you're going to allow a demon to drink. And sometimes you got to think like that. When you, when you reach those points amongst those demons, they could be family, friends, associates, no matter. You got to. Sometimes you got, that's what God gave your ego for those times. It ain't got nothing to do with vulnerability at that time. You use too much vulnerability at that time. That's how you get washed away. You got to use a little ego with no vulnerability at all. When you have allowed demons to suck you in their world too much and make you feel like what you doing ain't even value. And you need to value they flunkness that go nowhere more than, more than you doing what you doing for them to even care enough to put you down that gift trip. So you have, to, you have to keep that in mind. You'll be around demons and stuff like that, that they don't know they're demons. And they automatically start to blah, 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 and turn into an agent. You know what I'm saying? And this is how you know they turn into an agent. They start telling you things that make you feel like, oh, this is these are versions of me being normal again. All the way down to you, a person who probably just got out of high school and you're getting all this weird pressure that you, it's time for you to go to college and things of that nature. Now, there, let's say, now I'm not saying anything wrong with this, but I'm just saying Within a context, I'm trying to give you all examples of agents on the most surface level ever. You might have a, a situation where you're like, damn, I could go I could go straight to the NBA. I don't want to go to college and shit like that. Things like that. Or I could go straight to that beauty salon shit. Uh, Tyra Banks is trying to give me a, a, a contract right now. I could go straight to uh, American Next Top Model. I have to go to college, mom. I don't have to go to college, dad. Grandma, grandpa, auntie, however the case may be, uncle. Now, look, here's the thing. The moment that it doesn't matter how much money Tower Banks sent you in your bank account that you could show them, or it don't matter how much the, the coach that came to your house to talk to them and be like, yeah, this is a talent right here. I would love them to be on the team. If if your parents start saying like, oh, no, nah, but this is important for the, uh, that, 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 they did that agent, they turned into an agent. That's what it means. So they still look like the person. They're not going to turn into no actual agent like the Matrix, but it's an allegory. This is what the Masons made as an allegory on what happens when the individual turn into an agent. They basically just turn into the norm or the news channel or 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 the book that they read in front of you. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, they still that person. But the, the, everything that's coming out their mouth is the news channel or the book they read or their their indoctrination or what they expect from you and shit like that. And that's when that person did that and turned into an agent. So that's not to fully detach from individuals. That's to learn how to correlate how you react and respond to them. So in your own privacy, you're not allowing their influence to prevent you from doing anything. You know what I'm saying? So keep that in mind. Well, I appreciate y'all from hitting that like button in this motherfucker shit because they playing with my motherfucker. I don't know why they playing with my views. Just give me my views and shit like that. They don't. They don't want me to be the the, the new. Uh, uh. Well, I'm already am. I appreciate y'all hitting that damn like button.